Hey guys, Alex Cyclos here, back with just a quick uh, initial impressions here of the Bontrager Iolas uh, saddle here. So I had been trying to get along with the Selly Italia Novus Boost Evo Kick Carbino that was on this bike, which is my trainer bike for about two weeks now. And it was fine, I had no problems with it, except I was getting like a little bit of a dull ache and I've always favored saddles with more of like a, an actual like, we'll call it like lift in the rear tail. Uh, and I do like the fact that this model here has a full cutout, but just wanted to kind of give my first impressions of it. You know, you can do some research on the saddle. Well, there's not a lot of videos on it, believe it or not, uh, but it is a very, it's a very comfortable saddle. Uh, the shape of it is pretty neutral. Um, and I, I also do like the width, the actual width is actually a little bit more narrow compared to the Selly Novus and also the uh, SLR version of that Selly. Um, I just feel like it's it, it definitely suits me well. Um, everybody has you know personal preference when it comes to saddles, uh, but I would definitely give this a try. I did buy the Elite version, which has the uh, titanium rails, just to get it on the bike to try it and. Um, if I get along with it, I will order the RSL version, which is kind of like the S-Works of, uh, of, of Bontrager saddles. But it has a very nice shape to it. Definitely very supportive. And I've always liked saddles that have a little bit of a, of a lift or wave in the back to help rotate my pelvis forward just a little bit. I'm not very flexible. Uh, but the padding is very, very comfortable. Um, these independent wings we'll call them uh, are pretty compliant i can just imagine how comfortable it is maybe on a on an outdoor ride but what i like about this saddle is that the again the cutout goes the full length but i specifically like that when you are rolling forward into the drops to to get a little bit more aero um, that this whole area here does a pretty good job of supporting the sit bones if you're comparing this to the likes of like a S-Works Power Arc or S-Works Power, it is very, very narrow in here. And you do get a little bit of pressure. Uh, so I do like that this definitely, me personally, again, supports, supports my sit bones uh, as I do rotate forward here. As you can compare to my S-Works Roman Evo, the cutout is not very deep. So even though that there is a cutout here, because the padding is so dense and so minimalistic, um, this cutout, yes, it's there visually, but I don't really feel the benefits of it personally uh, because, again, it's just kind of very shallow. So it's under, 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 you know, when your bibs are on it, you know, and you're putting all your body weight on it, it just seems like it just is compresses and it's just, there's really no cutout there. And comparing the Roman, uh, it's a very, very narrow saddle uh, in this section here when you're comparing it against the Bontrager. This is my Phenome uh, Pro that was on my bark so I use this more towards mountain biking but I am going to try the Selly saddle on the mountain bike uh, over the weekend to uh, see how that kind of goes but I've been finding that as I'm aging or just for preference I don't know body's changing that you know I'm just no longer getting along with specialized saddles so I've, I've used them for six seven years and they're just kind of getting uncomfortable now uh, so don't really know why, why that's happening but here we are on a quest for a new saddle so um I will go ahead and keep you guys updated here on the uh, the Aeolus in terms of how I'm getting along with it. But I mean, just initial impressions, just sitting on it, and I did about 15 miles the other day indoors. Uh, it felt great. Uh, a nice little pocket. Not a lot of room to move around because this wave is pretty pronounced, but it is extremely comfortable saddle. Uh, but again, not a lot of, um, you know, real estate here to uh, to move around on. So... Uh, but yeah, we'll see. I, I'm really liking the uh, the padding and uh, the little bit of flex that's in it. So I'm just curious to see how this uh, will, will feel outside. So yeah, just uh, if you have any questions, just shoot them into the comments and uh, we'll get back to you. Appreciate it. Thanks.